In this first demo, we are going to highlight an application that utilizes sections and views, related tables, and triggers and actions. If you view the screen, you'll see that there's a map that is in the center of the screen with a lot of real estate. There's a legend over on the right. Those items are always on the screen. They are not a part of the section frame. The section frame is over here on the left where you currently see this list of properties. This list of properties is within a section frame and the list itself is the first view within the section frame. If I were to click on a property to view its details, then its details come up in a second view. This, this properties panel is the second view within a section frame. And you can see that when I clicked on that property, the further details came up and these details are based on a related table. The map also zoomed to that location. And so if I want to go back to the list, I actually created this button that says back to list, but what it's really doing on, on the back end is it is going back to the first view, which is the list of properties. So this is how you can create a very highly dynamic map application that suits a specific purpose for finding further details on an asset, but in a really concise way that doesn't clutter that initial screen. 